Hey everybody, how you doing? Hopefully doing good. If not, hopefully I can cheer up, at least distract you. Alright, let's see um how loud this is. Uh, it's probably not that loud. That's probably pretty good. That's just um I think I ha I started out with five credits. Um uh, I'm gonna show you something. Uh, even though I already did it, I'm gonna do it again. I'm gonna press start once. Up, down, left, right, up, down, left, right, up, down, left, right, up, down, left, right, up, down, left, right. Excellent. Until it says excellent. Then you press start. You go to the bottom. It's already set up to five credits, but right here, once it says, so it's up, down, left, right, it's, until you get, it's supposed to be a certain amount of time, but I miss every now and then. So until you get excellent, then right here, it's usually on four, and you can move it up to five credits, okay? So there you go. And let's start the game. Um, I'm gonna start with the menacer. I got the menacer, and um, uh, I don't know where to press start on. That's what I forget. What's start and what's pause and stuff on the menacer. I'm just gonna press the. Uh, I don't know. What is the start button? I guess I start with the uh, regular controller. Hope this works. Got to move back a little bit. I remember. Gotta try not to get to the edges of the screen. See, I messed up there. Let's see if I can unpause there. What happened? Try not to touch any of the other buttons on the menacer. It's a touchy game. It's not that good. Um, the controls on the uh, menacer. Cartridge is fine. There's nothing wrong with the cartridge. And try not to get to the edges of the screen. Uh, you could wind up freezing a lot. And I think I, that's what I just did. Um, I, I did it again. And that's what happens when you um, do that. Um, so I apologize for that. When you hit the bottom of the screen, I think that's when it happens. Next time I go down there very carefully. That's okay, that was kind of lame anyway. Enjoy as much of the game as you can, you know. So now I know where the start button is. There's an extra man right there. Shield. The top button of the menacer is um, the bombs. So you gotta be pretty far back. Unfortunately, mine, um, mine is attached to a wire because I modded it, power modded it. I wonder why, why this one doesn't start over as much. If I hit the bottom, does it start over? It doesn't do it like the first stage. See that? I don't have too much of a problem with this. Oops.
trying to be as smooth as I can because it's so it's so far away. It's not far away. It's just my TV is only nine inches. So the first stage, it just it just act wacky. That's the case because um, you probably seen the first stage. Um, some of you um, probably want to see the second and third. This one I might skip. So start and select. Let's see what it is. Let's see what it is. So you can't just have the menacer, you have to have the sensor bar. It's a, like a sensor bar from back in the days. Infrared, I guess. Come on, where are you? Yeah, we're gonna skip this. I remember now, go to the bottom button, pause it, and then the other top two buttons, top button, then the second button together. Skip all this stuff. Because this is a, this stage is impossible. That's why you gotta know some codes. I'm showing you quite a bit. I like showing you this this game actually. Um, it's a cool Lycan game. fun stage coming up right here. Oh, free man. Wow, this seems smoother than usual. I've had harder times with this before. Take him out in seconds. Wow, 
Uh oh, I'm in danger now. Wait for the countdown to go first before you, um... I think I'm gonna make it. Wait for the countdown first. Now let's go. That's it for me, ladies and gentlemen. Take care. Please like and subscribe if you feel like you're feeling me. Be blessed. T2, the arcade game for Sega Genesis. And you need a menacer. And you need a in this in the you need a sensor and control port number two, and you need a controller and Control port number one.